Good day, good day! How the honk are you? Welcome to Roverland. Happy 4th of July, red, white, and blue. Yeah! Look at these babies right here. Yeah! Happy 4th of July. How the honky honk are you? Fireworks of glory, right? All right, well, if you're watching from across the pond, uh, don't be sore. We we had to do it. <laughs> anyway, talking about across the pond, big shout out to Lee Jackson. Hey, buddy, got a Freelander. Yeah, we're going to take a look at the Freelander. And let's see which model this is from. Bam! Oh, he got it right. All right, there it is. Willie, made in China. This is the Land Rover 2001 Freelander. And I think I pretty much bought these uh, in the store. Uh, these are the uh, pullback jobbers. And uh, yeah, so I think I, I, I bought these in the store. Uh, I could have bought some off of eBay, but I'm not sure. Uh, this one is uh, scuffed up a little bit, but a nice red. It is a little bit uh, fleck, fleck paint in there, uh, but a very, very nice model. Welly always does a great job at um, doing, doing their models. And uh, Freelander, I, I'd love to have a Freelander just like this. This is uh, probably the next vehicle I will buy, uh, hopefully. Well, uh, looking to the side here, very, very nice, accurate, uh, I feel, the uh, V Land Rover um, wheel of choice, I'm, I think. <laughs> Side marker, no rear um, uh, reflective tape or silver on the back of the mirror there. It does have, and I wish we could stay focused here, uh, it does have a nice Land Rover badge right before the... Uh, the tri window there right behind the door b pillar and uh just very nice i guess we're gonna try doing this and maybe that'll keep it in focus if you look closely and i always love this little uh rib bumping here i always thought that was cool uh if you look closely ba bam check it out it has opening door features and as you can see right now, yes, this is uh, Lee's car, even, although his is black. Uh, <laughs> it is a right hooker. Yeah, so uh, this one's for you, Lee. Uh, I don't believe the tops uh, come off on these. Uh, just kind of taking a look here with the glass and everything. I don't think that that's removable on this model. Well, let's take a look at the back since that's swung around here. I love the detail on the uh, rear bumper. It has the molded uh, Land Rover on the bumper. Sorry for the uh, the uh, uh, shadow there from the big, nice uh, spare tire. Uh, lens details in there. Very nice. Uh, plastic inserts with the red taillights. Uh, Land Rover in, uh, badge on the... Um, License plate uh, handle, that's the door handle, license plate light, and a place to put the badge. <laughs> 388LRV. That's right, 388LRV. Remember that number. All right, as we swing around here to the driver's side, uh, you can see we have a nice uh, gas cap there. Nice that uh, the, the bumpers are gray, and they did paint in on the metal body. Uh, the gray to kind of match that. Uh, let's take a look inside here. Oh, they got that steering wheel right down there low. Yeah, low and slow as she goes, huh? All right, very, very nice. No details on the, the dash, but very detailed though, as far as the molding goes and things like that. Very nicely detailed, nice seats in there. They look like they could move, but I don't believe they move, really. Um, yeah, they, they, I, I, they're two-piece. The back does snap on there, uh, but very, very nice model. Let's look at the front here and uh, get in focus again. All right, welcome back, camera. Uh, the front um, 
uh, Land Rover is kind of wonky. It's kind of off. I don't know, really. I think I think it's the right size. I think it's the right scale. It just doesn't go with the hood. I think I don't think it goes straight across. Correct me if I'm I'm wrong there. Um, but uh, very nice. It has the uh, uh, European license plate 388LRV with the uh, Land Rover badge on the grill. Uh, two color uh, headlight piece there. Uh, it's clear, and then they do something to the backside to make it yellow on the side. That is really, really sharp. Uh, just really nice. Does not have uh, the uh, sunroof or uh, pop-out roofs or whatever there, uh, but it, it is painted in there, so very cool. And it does not have the external uh, grab bars there. So, All right, let's move right along. Let's get over here to the white one, see if we can uh, really get anything any different. Um, not really. It looks very, very much the same. The white is a very nice uh, co color, so you can uh, see uh, a little bit, maybe a little bit more details in the in the body lines and stuff like that. Um, but uh, very, very, very nice. I love it. I love it. I love it. Yeah, there's just something up with that front Land Rover uh, on the front. I'm just not certain what it is. But uh, yes, very, very nice. I like that white one. That is very, very cool. Now to the blue one here. This one is very snazzy. Yes, snazzy. I said snazzy. Cheese balls. <laughs> Ah, yes, and uh, here is the sticker on this one. Yeah, that, uh, there you go. Yeah, interesting enough. But yeah, check this snazzy paint job out. Blue, metallic blue, very, very uh, uh, snazzy. I, I <laughs> if you're doing a drinking game, uh, the word of the, 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 the day is snazzy. So if you, uh, you know want to do a drinking game get get the bottle and every time i say snazzy take a drink all right <laughs> all right very very nice awesome uh red white and blue thank you very much uh for all that uh participate in uh fourth of july this is awesome this is great I really uh, enjoy the Freelander, and uh, I just so happen to look on my shelf. I'm like, what do I do next? And I'm like, yes, sir, red, white, and blue. Here we go. And what would the 4th of July be if we didn't have a little Hershey chocolate to go with it? Yeah, some s'mores. Yeah, if you don't know what a s'mores is, uh, <laughs> it's a graham cracker with a marshmallow with... Uh, uh, Hershey's candy bar in there. You, you melt the marshmallow on the campfire and then you squish it between your your uh, your uh, graham cracker and uh, the melt the, the chocolate and you got the all time American favorite pastime s'mores. Yes. Alright, so anyway, so this here is a um, comes with a trailer too and a car on it. Um, interestingly enough, this is the best one I've got. And, and then I have this one here and I bought these off of eBay and then I have this one here. Yeah, this is the first one I bought <laughs> and, uh, yeah, the, the hitch is busted off it, but these are the same thing as these motorized ones. And, and, oh, this one doesn't really motorize anymore. Huh? That one, that one, the blue one's busted. All right. Well, anyway, but these are, are, um, the non-motorizing ones, and they came with a trailer, and here's the trailer hitch here, kind of just kind of was an add-on there, I guess, and uh, it, uh, yeah, so it was a two-piece gift set. I don't have anything other than the Land Rovers. Uh, yeah, so those are kind of cool, but uh, the brown is a nice chocolate brown. Yeah, same identical thing. Except for, check this out, ba bam! look at that, black interior. Yeah, that'll keep your chocolate nice and uh, melted. Uh, this one here is uh, like the, the best one that I've got. 
very nice. It's just a plain brown. It's it's not uh, uh, metallic at all or anything like that. But it does uh, have the Hershey on the door. Nice black interior. And but this one is missing the uh, hitch on it. Uh, they they did uh, clip that off or whatever. I'm not sure. But uh, there you go. All right, so you know what? Uh, I've got this bugger here. Now, interesting enough, check this out. I just noticed this as I rolled this one up on screen. Um, if you guys noticed here, um, nice black interior there, and uh, nice black interior there, and this one is definitely a Hershey's but it has a gray interior now go figure how in the world can I take this apart I and mean, this is pretty rough shape missing the rear tire and it is the same um, uh, vehicle uh, the body you know they changed the base but it is the 388 LR V so uh, same same car there with the same license plate and uh, just just really kind of cool i like that so all right well that's gonna do it uh showing you what i got for the wellies welly uh the land rover one uh 2001 freelander and uh as you noticed yeah the bases were different you probably were looking at that while i was yapping but anyway very very nice uh i am uh i was thinking about doing something and and um uh changing this or making a new one or uh i'm hoping to buy another one of these so i could make this one uh back to uh snuff you know restore it uh now that i see that the interior is different i guess i don't want to take that apart i was thinking about taking it apart and letting you show show you what's going on there but uh i really don't want to do that i just kind of hesitant now <laughs> all right well, there you go, ladies and gentlemen. That's it for me today. Happy 4th of July to all you here uh, that uh, want to celebrate. Excellent, excellent. Otherwise, you guys have a happy Friday. Uh, come over. Make sure you subscribe. Yeah, I'm going to point down here. Make sure you subscribe. Uh, make sure you tell your friends. Share this video. And, uh, yeah, come over to Facebook. on. Uh, oh, hey. Roverland. Hey, oh, wait a minute. I got a uh, shameless self-promotion. <laughs> shameless self-promotion. July 12, 2020, we're going to give away um, uh, to celebrate the one-year anniversary of Roverland. And uh, so I, I'm going to post some stuff on uh, Facebook too. But uh, it's a Sunday, so make sure you're available. And uh, yeah, get, uh, get subscribed up because you can't win the boxing video that i'm going to do and box up stuff from uh the land rover collection and uh yeah so that's going to be fun so roverland on facebook roverland channel on instagram and that's it you guys have a great day oh uh, no wait slow traffic keep right <laughs> and have a great rover day